lean mixture, burning oil, and idle vibration can often be symptoms of a faulty exhaust valve. Traditionally, you would detect exhaust valve issues by opening the oil cap and checking if there's any strong suction going on, and then to pull out the oil dipstick to see if there's any noticeable shaking. But these methods are limited to detecting severely damaged exhaust valves. For early stage issues, relying on negative pressure values is crucial. Different vehicular models and engines have varying negative pressure values. During oil burning or major overhaul, using a negative pressure gauge is essential. When using the PT520 digital manometer to measure the crankcase exhaust valve's negative pressure, you can switch between 10 different units of measurement, typically sticking with millibar. This gauge allows flexible recording and storage of data, including the crankcase's never negative pressure readings. Normal values should ideally reach at least 85%. Anything lower indicates potential oil leakage or minor oil burning. Uh, and then when values start dropping below 30%, that suggests severe and complete exhaust valve damage, and then you have different problems.